Tonight, the man police have been searching for for the last 48 hours has been caught. He was arrested hundreds of miles away in Barstow. 46 year old Stephen Houck now behind bars. 23 ABC's Alyssa Flores has the latest details from Lancaster, where Houck is in custody tonight. After over 48 hours on the run from Los Angeles to Bakersfield and eventually Barstow, that's where law enforcement finally caught up with Stephen Houck hiding inside of an empty rail car. Tonight, he's behind bars here in Lancaster. The man that led law enforcement on a chase in an RV for hundreds of miles from Los Angeles to Kern County, lasting over three hours. Finally caught two days later in Barstow. Los Angeles Sheriff's Department says Hauk was hiding inside a compartment of an empty rail car in a Barstow rail yard when detectives from the Fugitive Task Force arrested him without incident at around 4.30 Thursday evening. LASD says a weapon, however, has not yet been recovered. The manhunt for Hauk began after the multi-county RV pursuit came to a halt in an orchard north of Bakersfield on Tuesday. That's where California Highway Patrol says it was in a matter of seconds and because of lack of visibility due to dust that Hauk managed to escape on foot. His two children, 11 months old and three years old, also inside of the RV during the pursuit. They were brought to safety by SWAT, now in the custody of their mother. Authorities continued the search for Hauk for two days and believed he was armed and dangerous before finding him Thursday evening. Hauk, a parolee who was wanted for sex crimes out of the state of Oregon, was also wanted out of Santa Clarita for assault with a deadly weapon, child abduction, terrorist threats, and evading. Thursday night, Hauk transported from Barstow to the Lancaster LASD station, where he has been booked for several charges, including kidnapping, assault with a deadly weapon, criminal threats, and domestic violence. 23 ABC spoke to Hauk's sister, Edwina Jack, who says she's relieved his capture was not deadly. Well, I'm glad it didn't come down to him being killed, um, but he's still a marked man. I'm just glad it's over.